braided lords of Celtis surrender and shake. Their magna burned alive as they watch. Stripped of magic, the armies of Glaivegate fell. To Sandrak, the bold and terrible tyrant of Rayshard. They called him their ruler, as he was of east and west. And the horns of their ancestors trumpeted blood in protest. Hardcore. Hush. Passage to the sands of Oroman was secure. The Sky Islands, careful. Ever war I'm being careful. With winged as careful as last time. Careful, uh. And the That's not a word. Earth yawned wide as he spoke, declaring the madly of their order now vanished. Damn. You think Sandrak really talks like that? I'm concentrating. Maybe he bores his enemies to death. I'm concentrating. But. Mine. But I am not. The man, I am not the man content to simply wander. I am. I'm wandering every third word. I'm distracted. Go, go, go. No one cares about R.C. Norman. Hold it up. Sandrak's coming our way. Got it. Let's go. Ladies, gentlemen, everyone, please take your seats. Hey, wait up. Luna! Over here, Jack. Did we get? We. I provided moral support. Mm -hmm. Maybe the others made out better. One can hope. Did Caleb ever tell you his plans for this caper he's got in mind up in Topside? I think he just likes to say caper. 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 It's a fun word. It feels sneaky. Also, you two stay out of Topside. No one's using the cargo lift. Come on. So I wasn't paying attention. What was the play about? Um, Kalthus surrendered to Sandrak, and then he burnt all their magna. Alive. Well, that's not nice at all. What kind of message does that send? It's pretty rude, if you ask me. That Sandrak is a boss. That's what it says. You missed the part where he's called the Tyrant of Rashan, right? You said you weren't paying attention. Maybe I just wanted to see what you took away from it all. Let's cut through the market. Sure, but let's keep an eye out for the constables. The market seems kind of dead tonight. There's talk of a bunch of airships coming into dock. Some hivers probably think they can make easy money unloading cargo. Maybe that's what we should have done instead of stealing from the hat guy. He was a bust. By any metric, a man with a hat indicates a perfectly respectable mark. That sounds made up. Tell them. Are you gonna tell them? Maybe. I don't know. Feels late for it now. You made it late. Because I hate goodbyes. Sure. I get that. What's up? Uh, you're in no hurry to get back. No. You're thinking how much you're going to miss this garbage heap. Please, would you? Don't call my home a garbage heap. I don't want to spend my life living above a bottomless hole in the ground, Jack. 
We don't technically know if the wound is totally bottomless. All signs point to yes. They'll be okay, Luna. I'll watch over them. We- I've got an idea. Target practice? Why not? It's our civic duty as citizens of the Seren Underbridge. It's janitorial work. Probably would have made more money clearing off these large barnacles than we did at that play. Fair. You're all about duty right now, aren't you? Nice. You'll make a good soldier. I hear they give better uniforms to the lightless that can summon a little magic like this. There's a war, Jack. It's not about the uniform. Or maybe it's better boots. Cheese, Jack. Wait, what? Soldiers get to eat real cheese. Boots are just extra. Huh. Rashan's got no idea what's coming. Make corporal, I can even buy land. A whole farm just full of boots. Look, I know I keep saying I get it, but I don't. Not really. You're the first person I've met that actually wants to fight in the Everwar. No one escapes the draft, Jack. They do all the time. You're not even going to try. Besides, I don't want to fight in the Everwar. I want to fight for Lucium. Exactly the same thing? Just shut up and shoot. They ship you off to fight in the Ever War. Where do you think they'll end up sending you? Who knows? Maybe I have just enough magic not to be considered lightless, and I'll have a say in where they send me. A Magnus gets a say. Probably. No offense, but what we do is kind of like. Pew, pew, pew. A Magnus is like. Pow, bing, brrr. I mean, it's not even a con. Yeah, some magic might as well mean no magic, as far as the Magna are concerned. Mel Fife stew from here. Pretty sure the whole neighborhood can. You know, everything he cooks tastes vaguely like regret. <laughs> We're home. Jack! Whoa! No love for the boss? Come here. Are you leaving us? You turn 16 in the morning, and that's when the soldiers fear you into the army because Jack said life is unfair. Or you could ignore the draft like a normal person. Happy birthday. No one tells me anything. How'd you score? <sighs> We're officially the worst street thieves in Seren. Hopefully Caleb redeems us. <sighs> Dug this out of the back of Troy's place. I guess we can act like it's cake. Oh, no. You're not eating that. Shoo. Sure. Probably wise. Stew's almost ready anyway. Grab us some tubers from up top, Jack. Sure thing. Tubers? Let me know when Caleb gets here. I've got something I want to tell you all. Like that you're leaving us? Shut up, you. What do you put into stew when it's someone's birthday? What? Birthday stew. What goes in it? Yeah, that's not a thing, Fife. Want to try it? I know you two haven't eaten all day. No way in hell am I eating that. More for the rest of us, then. Rude ass.
are you doing, Rugrat? Stole some posters, added them to my scrapbook. Wanna see? Sure. But what's with you stealing posters? It's part of the historical record, Jack. Join the fight. No thanks. This propaganda is going to rot your brain. Is that what happened to Luna? Brain rot? Is that why she's joining the Lights Army in the morning and leaving us? Yes, sir. No, sir. No one escapes the draft, Babs. Plus, I really think Luna believes it's the right thing to do. Why is fighting in the Evil the right thing to do? Look, I never said it was. And you better not tell Luna I said anything. She pretty much thinks I already have. I know you told them. I did not. Well, something's got them all riled. Look, it's not like it was hard to figure out you're leaving. You're packing bags, you're crossing out days on the calendar, you're reading big, fat, official-looking books of... What is it this time? The Officer's Manual of Lights Army Regulations. See? No way that gave away the store, right? <sighs> what are you thinking? Would you rather fight a hundred-foot-tall crab or one hundred one-foot-tall crabs? The day may come. You should seriously think about it. Like a Vecchi crab or a crab crab? Does it matter? It's a hundred feet tall. Then fine. The hundred foot tall one. <laughs> Why that one? There is glory in that one. <laughs> Idiot. Look, I'm seriously innocent. They just figured it out. Yeah, I know. I just don't want to know that they know. Not yet. I'm sure we'll all act surprised when you finally tell us. I'm gonna. Just... Just let me know when Caleb's back. I'll do it all in one big go. Babs is going to miss you. It'll be good for her. She'll be in charge before you know it. Already acts like she is. She's a natural. Fife has a guilty look. Because he's eating us out of house and home. All those apples you nicked yesterday? Gone. Those were supposed to last a week! They lasted an hour. Caleb's out late. I approved it. He's a good earner. Something's been really off with him lately. He's just impulsive. He'll grow up. You all will. So what's in that book of yours? Lights Army Regulations, duh. Sure, but like, the worst one. You have to wear a surprising number of reflective belts. <laughs> what? No, I mean it. Maintaining the grounds at the keep? Reflective belt. Directing constructs to clear the roads? Belt. 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 I didn't expect the Everwar to be so safety first. Or so polite. I'm going to have to learn like 20 different salutes depending on Magnus officer ranks and the color of magic they use. Unless it's a foreign dignitary, then it's a weird kind of ancient curtsy. You, you, you know it's just going to be trenches and spell smoke, right? Night blades hacking away at everyone. Yeah, probably. You should keep quiet about being from Saren. What do you mean? The Lucians. They don't really like us. Only because we constantly say that Saren isn't really part of Lucium. But it's not. Seen a map lately? Maps don't count. All right, they, they just do that so they can conscript us into the Light's army. Just don't say anything, okay? Saren is home. It's a ramshackle wonderworld built by the lost, the low, the lightless in the margins. Hanging above the wound with all the defiance her forebears passed on to their children. There's no finer city in Lucium than Saren, rickety in everything but faith. That's what I'm going to say, and you can't stop me. So, learn anything new about the Magni in your book? Just that Magni don't have to actually read it. What, like they have their own book? Wouldn't know. That's a different world from ours. The only time the regulations mention the Magni is when it's about how to do exactly what they say because they know best. Psh, you're probably smarter than half of them. Magic can't conjure wit. Ben Tilly used to say that. Before, you know, she mysteriously disappeared. All right. See you at dinner. You bet.
right, Jack? Just remember to be super supportive of her when she tells everyone at dinner. What's up? All right. See you at dinner. You bet. Happy birthday, Luna. I hit it big tonight. Think fast. Your present, such as it is. What's that in it? Pentasite. No shit, I mean the swirly stuff. Looks like snow. What's snow? I don't know, wintertime shit. They say it's in Caltus all the time. Looks pretty as all. Oh! Caleb! Oh, yeah. I'm sorry. Move your hand. Let me see. Constable got a lucky shot. I'll be... Ah! Oh, damn it, Jack! It's not good. Did they follow you? You got yourself hurt over this thing? Careful, Caleb. Your guts are split. Why didn't you... I didn't want to ruin your birthday at all. That's dumb. Jack, come on. We need medicine. I've got an idea. Explain on the way. You guys, watch him. Get the rags and the water, and don't let him sleep. You know how to do this. We'll be quick. So, what's the plan? I'm still making it up, but I'm pretty sure it's this way. You're making it up? It's gelling. Have faith. Caleb's gonna be all right. The nobleman buying all the housing in the East Nets in Harrow's Edge. That's the mark. That's, uh... That's the they'll kill you kind of place, Luna. Noble means rich. Rich means magic. Magic means... What? I don't know. Healing crystals or something. Drugs from Topside. I mean, I don't have a better idea. Yeah, no, this, this is smart. They say he's old. He'll have all kinds of medicine. It's a good play. You're saying something you're not saying. It's just, this kind of thing comes naturally to you. Like, it's so natural, you didn't even know what our plan was gonna be when we headed out, and now, bam! Here's how we're getting out of this. You're going to do great when I'm gone, Jack. I promise. Those are lights on me, soldiers. Your new best friends. Funny. Looks like they're in a hurry. What do you think they're doing here? I don't know. It's weird. Over there. That manor. That's where we're going. Huh. Okay, then. Game face, Jack. Yep. What any of this stuff is. What color is life magic? Life magic? Look, I don't know. I think it's green. Just look for green.
Check it out. Oh, shit. You didn't say he was a Magnus. Do you know how to work a sigil? Pfft, no, you don't either. Details. Just open it or whatever. Is that your definition of being careful or? Whoops. What are we gonna do with it? Wiggle it at Caleb? Maybe. Wh what do you mean, maybe? Uh oh. Shit, let's get out of here. Run, come on, this way. That's the city along. Uh, just for us? Saren's being attacked. Air raid. It, it, is that? It's Rashan. Sandrax attacking the city. We have to get back to the others. Come on. We've got to get home. Chance they're not dead. They know what to do in a raid. We made them practice. You did. I made jokes the whole time. Feel guilty later. Ah! Ah! Are you all right? Right. Right behind you. Almost there. It's just up ahead. It's shock. Don't let it in. How are you already a soldier? I'm just acting like I figure they act. Jack! Luna! Come on! We can make it! Jack! You aren't done here, asshole! What are you doing? Just run, Jack. It's okay. No! Don't!
They have names for what you are. An unforeseen. A candle of Shaled. A child of the rivers. Lucky. In this case, yes. The next time it happens, it might kill you. We're driving the Rasharnians back from Saren. But you aren't safe here anymore. They'll hunt you down. You'll need help. Jack. You'll need help, Jack. I'm Grand Magnus Kirkin of the Order of Immortals, Field Marshal to the Light's Army. You can add late to all that. Fine. I know who you are. Seen the posters. Join the fight. So, Jack... Are you going to? The power inside you, it comes from the ley lines. All magic in this world does. And those of us lucky enough to be able to catch that magic can make it do almost anything we want. Uh, okay, back up. This world? That's right. There's another under this one. The Shrouded Realm. That's where magic starts. Where the ley lines pour out from. Look at them, Jack. Try to see the web they make. Do I have to close my eyes or something? Uh... No. No, not at all. Just look at that ley line there, and then let yourself see through it. Everywhere. Yes. They cover Avium like a net, bathing it in magic. This is why we fight in the Ever War. Politics, land, ideologies, all of that is secondary to the control of magic. Who's we? The Magni Orders. The armies those orders command. Now that the other kingdoms are either lost or scattered, only Lucian remains to resist the tyrant of Rashan. Sandrak. More and more, he drives all forces into the wound itself, casting them down into that bottomless void, under the watching judgment of the Pentasod. If it approves or not, it's never bothered to tell us. Almost out of time, Jack. Sandrak attacks us from all sides, and there is no place left to run. I know what you're about to say, but I'm not a soldier. I'll fix that.
shit. You've never seen the Pentasad up close. You saw how I lived under a giant bridge. A giant bridge, sir. Use it. What Rashan did to your home in Saren, they've been doing everywhere. Sandrak's forces are relentless now that Kalthus has fallen. This was all a sanctuary settlement of refugees fleeing the front lines before it became just another battlefield. It's as good a place as any to continue your training. This place is empty. Sandrak massacred everyone? Your sigils will help you focus your magic. Make it accurate. Keep it level. Prevent it from killing you. Your sigils mark you as a battle mage of Lucium and the Light's army. A Magnus. Yes. Now, get ready to fight, Magnus. Fight what, sir? Battlefields have memories, Jack. I'll wake them for you. This way. You weren't entirely without magic when we met. Innately, you knew how to defend yourself with it. Yeah, I really just knew how to clean weird gunk off the underside of a bridge. We all start somewhere. Right now, you need to learn how to defend yourself better. At range. Go to that spell altar there. It will teach you how to summon a shield. Take it easy, conscript. You're still vincible. Now let's see what you can do. You're what's called a triarch, Jack. The Pentasad has gifted you with the ability to manifest all three colors of magic. Some Magni only know certain colors? There are benefits to it. The more limited your palette, the easier it is to master. The triarch trades that mastery for versatility. That altar there holds your first red spell and a sigil to harness it. Take them both. Okay, do I take the blue one off? What? What? Oh, okay, I put the red one on my left arm. Got it. No, just... Just reach for the red sigil, Jack. Yes, neat. Now take the spell. Ugh. It it feels angry. 
spells are alive as well. Red magic is particularly violent, but the sigil will bend it to your will. Don't allow them to close in on you. If they do, switch to your red magic and blast them back. Know which of your colors is best in any given situation. Don't get overconfident. The Rasharnians will always have you outnumbered. You're hurt. Okay. Some spells are not focused through your sigil, but through a totem. Take that one. Whoa! I, I can feel it. Coiling. What is that? It's a lash. You can use it to pull enemies towards you. Most of them, anyway. The larger ones, not so much? Not so much. the colors, green magic is the most curious. It's the province of spirits, of death, life, and transition. Yow! Guessing this spell emphasizes the death part. Hmm. There is a war to win. This altar grants you the animate spell. Animate allows you to manipulate some objects into different shapes. Some? How will I know which ones? They have been marked by another Magnus with a glyph. Look for it. Find the green glyph on that statue there, then direct it. Ready yourself. Watch 
catch the archers. This is all so I can join the Lights Army? You already did by accepting a sigil from their field marshal. This is training. You mean you? You just give me one and boom? Boom, sir. And yes. Then tell me about the Order of the Immortals, sir. Back in Saren, you said you were their leader too. That's a... Are they a different thing? The Immortals are more than soldiers. We're the champion protectors of Lucian. It's Masters of Magic and Order Elite. With the tip of the spear. How many Immortals are there, sir? Too few. Remember to use more than one spell. Furies are powerful spells that will take great energy to cast. This one will allow you to break enemy shields. Sounds useful. While you constantly draw magic from the Shrouded Realm, it can drain quickly in combat engagements. Those crystals there, use them to replenish your magic quickly and stay in the fight.
This way. A single Magnus of the Light's army, with the right training, could have repelled Sandrak's forces here. Saved the lives of those that called it home. Yeah? And why didn't they? We can't be everywhere at once. So, kinda like Saren then. Save that anger for your final challenge. What is that? Prepare yourself, Magnus. You fall here, you die. That was impressive. The Oath Broken of Kalthus are a difficult challenge. Thank you, sir. High marks all around, Jack. Meet me topside. Those were just spectral, sir. When do I see a real fight? In time. There's more to learn than just spell casting. Like what? In your case, self-control. Why the frown, soldier? You've done well today. I just... I guess I... Look, 
Sir, I don't want to do this part. The just a soldier thing. Don't get me wrong, I'll fight. I promised a friend I would. Promised my family. Did you? It doesn't matter. What I'm getting at is I want to be an immortal. I want to fight this war as one of you. One of the elite. It doesn't work that way. With respect, sir, that lie is just so... How do I put this? I'm not buying it. All right, you're training me. Personally, you command the entire army of Lucium, and it's just what? It's, oh, hey, how about I raise a few phantoms here for this kid I just met because I guess I got time to spare? It absolutely works that way. Because then that makes you special. That's where this is going? Tell me, just how many soldiers do you think Lucium has left to train? Everyone that can fight already is, and we're still losing. Sandrax literally pushed us to the edge. Oh, I, w w well, uh... Yeah, I like your spirit, Jack. I like you. I found a child so lost and so angry whose new powers could easily make them a threat to the kingdom I protect. The choice was either to kill you or to turn you into a weapon against Rashan. Because we need everyone we can get. Back up. Option A was to kill me? Don't mistake my attention here for an endorsement into the Order, Jack. You'll put in the time, on the front lines, like everyone else. How much time are we talking? On deck. Our attention. Thank you, Marshal. Anyone that stood up needs to stay that way. Their next wave is moving in, and we've got positions that need bodies. The Rasharnians capture this ley line. We can all lie back down. Permanently. You're with Barker, right? I need him to line up his strikers along the eastern wall. There's a red division on its way. Yes, sir. Round two. Rasharnians haven't had enough yet? We haven't given them enough yet. That still work? Important one does. Good. You're Holland Mead's oldest, aren't you? Yes, sir. You've got a fear in your eye you don't need today, son. Sorry, sir. Today's the day they turn tail. I know these things. I told your father the same thing at Sundown 10 when he was your age. Sure enough, it happened then, too. Bit easier to swallow when you're immortal, sir. That's just a silly name to make our enemies cry at night. But this, this is real. No Rashanian spell gets through this today. Thank you, General. Surprised you're still here, sir. Isn't selection today? You know it is, Jack. And both of us know I'm ready. Guess it's too bad you're here then. Tell me why you want to be an immortal so bad. Serve Lucium. Don't. That'll just make me mad. You've had five years to come up with an answer to that question. I'm tired of hearing what your friend Luna wanted. You need to think about what you want. I... Our only focus right now is holding this ley line tower. First thing that happens if Sandrak gets it, he points the ley lines straight at our rivers. And our rivers decide they're not real anymore. 
An intelligence briefing showed me Sandrak can attune the rest of the towers he's captured to this one. Like a net. He's never been this close, has he? No. And if we don't stop him, he'll magnify his magical capability by a staggering amount. How staggering? Like I said, some serious end of times shit. No rivers, no fish, no need to fight if we starve to death first. And as Lucians, we love fish like you wouldn't believe, Jack. You love it so much that no drinking water is more of a side concern, apparently. Watch it. Yes, sir. the next wave. Sandrax overextending himself. Intelligence briefing say that? Or are we just hoping that's the case? We're just hoping. Today's the day they turn tail, sir. Switch on and get to the forward bastion. Yes, sir. Jack, you help us win this. I'll know you're ready. Gotta get to the forward bastion.
keep moving. Okay. I made the thing mad and it dropped me. I think it's heading back your way. I need you to do the same. Now. Rasharnians are this close to breaching the East Battlement. On it, sir. Just let me... Just let me get my bearings. You want to make selection today? You better find them fast. they doing out here?
Bell altar. I don't think I have a spell for that.
Armenian airship wearing Order of Masks colors just flew over my location. Going to check it out. Negative. I need you back here. We know it's headed in the same direction anyway. It's not bearing for the front at all, sir. They seem interested in some kind of temple way out here. An Order Magnus is beyond you, Jack. Debatable. Sir, it's the hand. You're sure? Okay then. Definitely sure. This just got very important, sir. Agreed. You're clear for recon only. Follow, but do not engage. Find out what the hand is looking for. Kirkin. Maybe engage a little. down that hole.
fine. Get out of here. Jack? What happened to the hand? She rabbited with some kind of artifact. Aristean by the look of it. I couldn't stop her. Understood. Get back to the front as fast as you can. We've got soldiers pinned down by that howler near the West Passage Gate. I'm on my way.
They're retreating. You had something to do with that. Just doing my part, sir. You did well today. Thank you, sir. But the hand of Sandrak. Any idea what she might have taken from the temple? I'll look into it. You, though. You're going to be late. Get to the Palathon. Selection starting soon. I mean, the Palathon's kind of a hike. Isn't there, like, a field promotion you could do? Nope. Come on, you and me, ushering in a new tradition? Battlefield selection. No more long lines, convenient. Dismissed. Because she believed in me. What's that? That's why I wanted it. Won it. So bad. I need to prove to myself Luna was right. 